it's the kid of games here welcome back to another brawl stars video in today's video we're doing the very first thing which i like to call a gadgetor so what a gadgetor essentially is is i'm going to be showing some gadgets and some quick tips on how to use them anyways before we get into these be sure to like and subscribe for more awesome content so today we're going to be showing up some subpar brawlers but also some of really good ones. So we're going to be showing Shelly's gadget, Edgar's gadget. We're going to also be showing where is he? Penny's gadget, Jackie's gadget, and BB's gadget. So we're going to be first playing BB because she is my is a really low brawler. Actually, now that I have tons of new brawlers, that I haven't pushed. Anyways, so we're doing lowest to high, highest. We're going to be doing Shelly at the last. Jackie after BB. Penny after Jackie. Shelly, actually, you know what? Let's get into this. Oh boy. So, the gadget that BB has is called Vitamin Booster, where she will heal up an extra amount of health. As you just saw, I activated right there and I got some quick health. So, what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to bait this Edgar into coming here he knows that i'm going to instantly just swipe him from with my back so this gadget is pretty good because everyone wants to go away from bb so that she can you know um so that they can kill her oh my god i'm actually getting beaten right now and i'm dead oh that's what you get apparently um everyone just ganged up on me Whatever, we're going to be playing another match because I don't feel like that did justice to our gadget because we only use it like twice. Anyway, so what Vitamin Booster does is BB heals for 2 seconds, 600 health. So that's about 180 health healed from her health. So yeah, it's going to make BB a bit tougher to kill because, you know, BB is going to be everywhere in, her f in the faces. So there's no obvious way. There's that oh yeah, that's not a baby. Anyways, obviously BB is gonna need some healing. Not just her regular healing because she's going to be beaten. So that's what this gadget is there. I don't know when BB's second gadget is releasing, but we're gonna be working with this first gadget. Because it's the only one that's there. Anyways, we're gonna try to get as much stuff done in this match. Ooh. Alright, six cubes stew. Now this is a good example to use the gadget. So, I actually am able to stay alive a tad bit more, not a big amount, against the stew here. So, and I was actually able to escape. If I didn't have my gadget there, I would be dead. Because stew would have easily killed me and the gadget wouldn't have given me that extra healing. So, this is show just shows how good BB's gadget is, even though BB is a very... Um, underrated brawler because you know BB is literally has such a small low small range so this basically shows how good BB is I mean you can show more survivability with BB so and technically you really need survivability with BB because you're going to be you know there's gonna be so many people trying to outrange you you know like this crow here you're gonna definitely need the gadget or like the 7 cube 8 bit over here Alright, back to winning this game. I'm gonna just get in this 8 but personal privacy. I forgot to freaking use the gadget. Of course. It's okay. We got second, third place. So that cancels out some of the trophies I lost. So, everyone, that is Baby's Vitamin Booster Gadget. Let's move on to Jackie's gadget. Jackie only has one gadget, and that's the one that's also really good, you know, by default. But still, though, it's pretty good, and most people like to use it. It's called Pneumatic Booster. So, what Pneumatic Booster does is, Jackie will instantly get a spot of movement speed for some time. So, this is really good in two situations. Either if you're running away, or if you want to quickly get close to someone. There's like only a couple of brawlers that can counter that. Mostly, people who can quickly go away. Kind of like Mortis, and this Mortis Stew. And it's really also good for running. Because everyone's gonna try to outrange you. After all, you're Jackie. You're not gonna get much value. I mean, so it's really good. Really. Say, look, say for example, this kind of rough target at me. 
Wow. Ridiculous. Anyway, so the Colonel Ruffs is gonna try to stay at distance. Watch. I'm gonna try to get in his business. He should be moving away. Yup. Told you guys. So this is the problem with Jackie. She doesn't have that much movement speed. But let's go on this Colonel Ruffs, guys. Okay, never mind. So the gadget is good in some cases. Ooh, ooh. Oh my god! Clutch! Clutch! No! Come on! Come on! Colonel Ruffs, go for the go for the freaking stew! No, I'm pinched! No! Brr! I'm pinched! I'm gonna make a run for it. Brr! The freaking rough shot ended up bouncing. And Ruff got the kill. <laughs> ah, we at least did good justice to the gadget. We didn't lose any trophies. But still though, first off, this gadget doesn't really get rid of Jackie's weakness, which is her close range. But still though, the gadget is pretty good, in my opinion. So, it's still, it's pretty good. It's eh, it's a meh gadget, really. Moving on to Penny. So, I actually have both gadgets for Penny, but we're gonna be using her first gadget called Pocket Detonator. Now, if you have Last Blast, Pocket Detonator is really good because you can just instantly just explode your turret and there's gonna be balls flying everywhere. Like, cannonballs, I mean. Of course. Anyways, this is not just good with Last Blast because, um, you know, this also produces knockback. So if an Edgar pops out of nowhere and you have a turret, you can just place it down, activate the gadget and quickly, quickly get some distance from him. Ooh. Oh no, I hate this man. My freaking friend ended up betraying me because she ended up shooting me once. Four trophies, oof. That's a major oof, guys. All right, let's get, let's try to get first place this time because we haven't done that at all. And it's only gonna get harder, guys, because my the other two people, Shelly and Edgar, are so high. In fact, my Shelly's at 600. Now, I know that you've seen YouTubers in this like 750, 1000, but still though, it's really tough. They make it look very easy. Anyways, let's continue with this gadget. So currently, I am not maxing out Penny because apparently uh, it takes a lot of stuff, I suppose, to max her out. Whatever. Anyways, so I know my Penny is power 7, I can upgrade her power 8 and I max her out next season. But I'm not doing that at the moment because I've already got a good list of brawlers that I'm going to max out next season. Ooh, we already added 5 cubes, guys. Anyways, moving on back to the game. Like I said, we're at 5 cubes and we're ganging up on this freaking Piper. Ooh, I've got a good prediction shot there. Okay, please don't super. No! Bro, I hate Piper. Why does this keep happening? Okay, you know what? We're sticking with this. I'm sorry. We didn't get any trophies from this, but whatever. And I know I've lost a couple of trophies. Moving on to our boy, Edgar. I think everyone has literally heard of this gadget. I know most people have this gadget. And I know most people know how to use it. But still, it's a gadget, so it's on the gadget tour. Anyways, this gadget is called Let's Fly. And it's one of the only gadgets that actually is good for charging supers. So, apart from both totem, of course. So, what happens is, it quickly uh, charges up your super. See, guys? So, you can instantly get a super whenever and whenever. It's a mere question of when do you want it. Which is the big thing, because everyone messes up on when they want it. Because they keep on uh, getting their super in times of unnecessary need. I mean, this also pairs well with Let's Fly, which is one of Edgar's... Um, this star powers which makes him do damage while landing anyways M's, M's and Colt are freaking teaming for some reason oh there's a good Carl here I'm just gonna stay near him there's no need to use my gadget at the moment because it's not a big situation where we need it right now so what we're gonna do is we're gonna save the gadget let our supercharge automatically boom so ladies and gents, we have our super, we still have two gadgets, so this is good. Now, we could bounce on Colt right now, but there's a very small chance, and I think it might happen, 
that Colt is gonna laser us to death. We can't jump on Spike, but I think we can actually jump on BB. Eat. Geronimo! Get the gadget on, activate it. Because that, I know that Spike's gonna go for me. Jump back to the other side of the river. I know that wasn't a good use for the gadget, but I just needed to do what I needed to do. Like I said, the gadget is you just not just to instantly like oh I need a super right now. You just if you're if you're low, oh wow, that's a lot of teamers. You know what that means? I know this is our last gadget, but it's for a good cause. Die teamers! Get out of here, you noobs! No! Are you choking? So this is the worst time to actually place down the spike super. 573 Edgar though, not bad. That's actually pushing away my Daryl. So that's sad. Anyways, final brawler. Shelby. The noobiest of them all. And the only starting brawler. Anyways, the gadget will be... We have both gadgets, both star powers. Everyone knows my Shelby's maxed. So, we're going to be using fast forward instead of clay pigeons. So that's probably going to come in the next gadget tour. And we're playing Band-Aid because Band-Aid is my new favorite star power from the star power build video. I showed that my favorite star power has to be Band-Aid right on cam. Anyways, so fast forward is another meh gadget because you can easily waste it in some situations. By the way guys, it's 600 range so I need to play. Look at this, look at this, look at this. So that's what you need to do. use fast forward to. You need to just quickly pounce on your prey. That's what you gotta do with fast forward. Like how I did with that search. Who kind who kindly like to demonstrate it? Anyways, guys, um basically that's what it does. It just makes Shelly just dash. It's another one of those dash gadgets. So this Leon clone. Boom, boom. If that's what it's used for. You just instantly activate and you just pounce on your enemies. It's pretty good. And along with Band-Aid, in case you if you get in a tough pinch. It's seriously good because then if you you'll just instantly heal up and you'll still kill the enemy that you want to kill of course and this is also good for running away of course all right guys so moving on to winning this match I actually got it all right we have a true silver Leon that is such a BM we have a night mecha crow Oh, um, he has, he doesn't have extra toxic, I think. Hold on. Alright, it didn't hit us a couple of times. Okay, this is bad, we Oh, yep, he has extra toxic. It did 600. Guys, if you don't know what extra toxic is, um, it's basically this stop power for Crow, where he'll actually sap down damage. Okay, so I think those, that bull and that Crow are teaming. I'm gonna try to get it. Oh, bruh, goodbye. Alright, let's get back to safety. Band-Aid still hasn't popped, which is good, guys. So we still have our Band-Aid. Leon died. Uh, okay. Oh, no. We have one gadget. We have one gadget, ladies and gents. This Leon could end our life right now. You know what? This counts as a win. Oh, Band-Aid! Band-Aid! Nope. Of course, we would lose. Anyways, guys, that's the end of our very first gadget tour. I hope everyone enjoyed. And don't forget to tell me in the comments if we should do more gadget tour videos. We were able to do a ton of stuff. We got a new 570 brawler that we could push. We have Shelly, who was at 612. Fortunately, we lost a couple of trophies from her. We lost a couple of trophies with Penny, but that's it. But then we also did some. Actually, we didn't gain any trophies with Jackie. But anyways, everyone, I'll be putting down a new video where I reach 19k and I open this mega box. And by the way, everyone, um, I know this is just a quick thing, but I'm definitely getting a legendary brawler soon. Whatever. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed everyone and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.